And now, ladies and gentlemen, the moment you all have been waiting for, an additional 20,000 euro are waiting for the overall winner who has been selected from all the excellent solutions we have just witnessed by a jury of more than 240 experts from around the world. Ladies and gentlemen, to reveal the overall winner of the ESNC 2015 from the golden envelope, please welcome on stage Ms. Dorothee Beer, State Secretary of the German Federal Ministry of Transport and Digital Infrastructure. Welcome. Well, ladies and gentlemen, is there anything more important and exciting in this very minute besides that Bavaria Munich starts the game versus Arsenal in this very minute? <laughs> but um, besides that, I guess not. So, um, ladies and gentlemen, competitors and inventors, winners of the regional and special prizes, it's always great to be one of the last ones who stands between you and the buffet but I think it's worth it. So we have seen an enormous, impressive array of cutting edge applications and ideas tonight so far, and I really have to meet some of you afterwards. For example, the um, guys from, I think, Poland, um, who helped us to have space in our trucks, so that's very important for our ministry as well. So I do very much hope that the European Satellite Navigation Competition will help to turn all these promising ideas into solutions that are commercially mature and generate added value for society. Clearly, the ESNC has become one of the most important driving forces for forward-looking satellite navigation application in recent years, and even more so considering that we have only seen the very best tip of the iceberg tonight. This year, as you already mentioned it, a record number of 515 visions were submitted, more than ever before. Therefore, I am utterly convinced, in a competition of ideas, in the end, there are always many winners, innovators and startups, businesses, and of course, the society. Notwithstanding, there can only be one overall winner, and you already saw him or her tonight already, of this year's ESNC. If you like, a competition of ideas is quite similar to a rocket launch. Endless hours of preparation and hard work have gone into an idea. And now, after weeks and months, everything is set for liftoff. The countdown is running, and the next 10 seconds will be very crucial. <laughs> it's way more exciting than when you compare it to the Oscars. So, um, ladies and gentlemen, we are now entering the final countdown of this year's ESNC. There stands, please take your time for a great, for a big pause, so, okay. The regional winner of the Valencian community, Poseidron, a maritime search and rescue drone, Please welcome on stage Enrique Martinez Asensi from Syncratec Aeronautics and his team. Turn off the music, thanks. It's not in the program, but maybe um, you would like to say some words. Maybe thank your parents, thank your hairdressers. I think um, <laughs> we should <laughs> we should allow you because I think it's very sad that no one who won was allowed to say something. So I changed the program. Here we go. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> 
Good night, everyone. Um, please, uh, first of all, I want to say thanks because I, I really like to have this opportunity of saying these little words to everyone. First of all, I want to thank uh, all our team from Valencia, Cinquete Canonatics, as this all started as a really crazy idea about something big, different. And we wanted it really to change how things work in search and rescue services. And we really wanted to make a point when it comes to the industry of the drones, moving it from what we see today to something completely different and dedicated to aeronautics. So thanks all, thanks everyone on our team, and thanks you all for this prize.